this is Isha and welcome back to my channel and today we are going to talk about really interesting thing it's actually a day which is all about us it's a women's day and so first of all a very happy women's day to all the beautiful women around the world from this beautiful women yes I am beautiful I am strong I'm powerful so you are my video is going to be all about women and the daily the, the life their routine the journey and their everyday life hurdles what they face and but still but still you know women is so strong like they still stay happy still stay strong still stay powerful and they take care of everyone around yeah i was talking to someone i was talking to one of my friends yesterday and about because as a new youtuber i was checking all the youtube videos you know what people actually do for the for the women's day i mean like how to celebrate it you know what what i can say about it but yeah and other things other what what i've checked there most of the videos most of the forums most of the things are all about the women who are speaking who are talking about this and uh, yes i feel very motivated uh, listening to them they make me very motivated they are kind of my role models as well and like other women's role models as well but you know what according to me you are your first role model if you love yourself you're going to do anything i can take myself anywhere where i want to go and i can achieve anything as i said like all the small achievements makes me happy and gives me courage to do more like when i started this youtube channel you know i was so scared i was like if you can check my first introduction video you can get it from there even today also i feel nervous all the time when i make these videos but then still you know i feel happy at the end result and i feel happy that yes i did one i made one more video you know i'm just going ahead i'm moving i'm taking step i'm I'm moving step by step you know and I'm achieving my goals I'm making others happy who are watching me and I am happy with that you know you know like if I talk about me what was my first achievement my first achievement was in my grade 7 when I learned bicycle you know that was the first achievement that makes me independent my parents were not going to drop me school I was going to school with that bicycle and I was independent, I was going there and I was coming back, you know, so that, that was an achievement. So they made me, even my parents helped me to learn that and they made me independent since, since I, was, I was younger, you know, I was in a school. So according to me, every small thing which makes you independent, which make you, which gives you so much courage to do new things, which give you um, fearless attitude, that is your achievement. So when I came here, I came here and uh, my first job what I did was a bartender. So yes, I, I was a bartender. My first job being in New York is a bartender in a restaurant, in a Korean restaurant in a city in Manhattan. But for me, that experience was amazing, amazing. I mean, like I cannot forget. But and even now as well, you know, if I got a chance, like I can definitely want to do a bartending job again. <laughs> Because you know, this is something which makes you really, really fearless. And uh, yeah, that's it. So my message to all the women around the world is, please consider yourself very important. Do not listen to anyone who is body shaming you or who is demeaning you or who is not giving values to your um, goals and your to your dreams. Please listen to yourself because you can only, you know, make yourself special i stay home with my son and uh, i am a full-time homemaker and a mother and yes now i can say this too that i'm an aspiring youtuber and a blog writer as well so yeah if you guys you know like this women day i have tried to collect all the thoughts of the women what they think about women's day and what they want to say and what they want to say to the other women around the world and I, ha I also attended a women's day, uh, there's a women leadership meet for the women's day uh, with one of my friends, she organized that and then I got to meet like few of the beautiful girls who were actually leading girl scout group and 
it was incredible you know i'm going to show you all those clips in that too and then i met catalina cruz who is an assembly member in new york city from queens and uh, it was it was amazing uh, meeting her and listening to her about her thoughts and about her story of struggle what she did and how she achieved her goals in her life you know and yes i'm going to show you everything guys so here you so here you go Thank you, we yeah. are excited. <laughs> this is Russia and it's called Girl Scout. We have two versions of the uh, two girls. We have younger and older. The youngers are called brownie are usually till eight years old and then older is obviously nine and up called scouts. Okay, and I have one question for you guys as well. Yeah. Listen, yeah. Linda. <laughs> How you guys are so cute and beautiful. Yeah. Just tell me. <laughs> tell me how you guys are so cute and beautiful. How? No answer? Because you're girls, that's why. That in different countries we have the same type of program, organization that helps young ladies like you to become leaders like we are. And so I wanted to continue to encourage you to do the work that you're doing now. Do your homework because I think I said that the last time we were here. You have to do your homework to make sure that you are going uh, out and helping members of your community. So if you are something as simple as if you are going to a supermarket and see if somebody needs the door open, hold that door open for them. Be that kind of young lady that is help for your friends because sometimes your friend might not ask for help themselves. And so be that person. And when I invite you to those phone parties, come with me so that we can all march and have fun. And we've done it before, and I'm so glad to see so many of the moms and the dads here that we're part of what we are building in our community, which is this new form of young women being leaders and knowing that we can do the work that needs to be done for us so that we can have better schools, so that we can have better neighborhoods, so that we can have the type of community that our parents have been working for. I don't know if a lot of you remember this, but I mentioned when we uh, when we had our sleepover downstairs, that my mom was a domestic worker when I was little. The women over here, you know, that were talking about what they've done, I noticed a big trend. We've all done something else before where we are at this point. It's not going to be that well. <laughs> um, because we were actually talking about that, and we've all done something else. This is my second career. It's just 
the decision that I made because, like I said, I had an interest in criminal justice growing up, and uh, and that's why I special, specialize in it in my bachelor's degree. And what's your name? My name is Amy Ricotta. Amy, and Amy is a Girl Scout, right? And these all are your batches, right? Yeah. Yeah. Can I, can I see your back? Yeah. So how you got these batches? Well, we go into many different places. Like the assembly woman, we helped her into going to Chupay and say, oh, go for her, Catalina Cruz. Yeah. yeah. Oh, so you had Catalina Cruz? Mm -hmm. yeah. Okay. For her campaign, right? Yeah. Her for the winning exactly. and she's the winner yeah. now <laughs> yeah okay and what else you do uh, we went to beaches several beaches and helped clean it uh-huh yeah and um uh, we cleaned the parks okay um, collected the leaves in um in autumn and you all the girl scouts go together right mm -hmm. we go and you to go and you go out for the camps as well right yeah, i've seen your pictures yeah, yeah. yeah. maybe the pictures and here's another scout we got, right? You want to say anything to all the girls around here? Be strong. Yes. And to the women like me? It was not me. Stay powerful and don't give up on your, your biggest dreams. Okay. Like Thank that. you. <laughs> Thank you very much. Yeah. Thank you. And anything else you want to say? Oh, like she said, stay strong. Um, if you have a... Um, like a dream, it's not, nothing is wrong in changing your dream, and stay strong. <laughs> thank you, thank you, Wayne. Again, now my name is Jeanette, and I am a Girl Scout troop leader here in Jackson Heights. And I am very happy to be a troop leader because not only do I meet young girls, but I encourage them to be confident about themselves, fearless and always to know that they could do anything that they put their mind to. Um, this is something that I never thought that I would be a troop leader, but I love it because I'm showing these girls different types, uh, different parts of life, and each and every one of them are learning to become leaders and they're seeing their role models by different parts of activities that we do here and encourage them every day to do their best and nothing but the very best. Yay, thank you. And they, they're gonna be like you, a strong and powerful woman. They're gonna be even stronger than me. They're yeah, I know, be, right? Um, confident about themselves so they can do anything they put their mind on. Thank you. Yeah, Thank well, you, Janet. Uh, we love you. Hi, guys. I'm Chita Sharma. I live in New York. I'm from India. And I just want to say on Women's Day, Happy Women's Day. And women be free, be independent. Life is too short. So enjoy your life and have fun. And this is my friend, Salon. So I'm right here. I just want to spread the message to be happy, happy, happy. And I work as a teacher in a school with toddlers. And, um, when I was in my country, I never worked, I never drove the car, but I came here, I drove the car, and I went to the beach, and, and in my country, I never went to the beach, I'm very free here, like a bird, I fly like a bird, and I'm very free, so from the women, be independent, be uh, more strong, because women still do everything, so thank you, take care, happy Women's Day. My name is Shalu, and I'm living in this country probably like 25 years. And since I came to this country, really, I worked very hard here. And I was, my country, I was a, a nurse. And I came here and I work hard here. Now this is my beauty parlor. And, and I'm a nurse from this place. Enjoy your life and be happy. You know, in this country, really, is a free country. And whatever people they want, they can do it. And this is like that. And women are beautiful. Happy Women's Day to everybody, every beautiful woman in the world. I have like three women in my life, my mom, my sister, and my wife. And I just want to say happy Women's Day to all beautiful women in the world. Hello guys, this is Kiran Saini. Uh, today is International Women's Day. So I would like to wish a very happy Women's Day to the woman who is strong, who is compassionate, and who is beautiful. And uh, may they be pregnant, not just today, but always. 
so i would like to request all the guys please respect the woman respect your mother respect your sisters and not just those who are in your family but respect all the women and all the guys from my side once again a very happy women's day to all the women's community all over the world bye bye take care have a nice day hi guys this is karan kaur so today is the international women's day so i am assistant manager in hospital side by side staff and modeling and acting career so i am on a successful my modeling career because this is i feel this is my passion so always be behind your passion and one day you can achieve this because women are more powerful than they think so mai chahti hu aap apne wishes apne dreams pure karo aap apne talent ko duniya ko dikhao ताकि आपको आपकी इनर स्ट्रेंथ का पता चले सो गाइस मेरी तरफ से यानी करण कौर की तरफ से आपको हैप्पी इंटरनेशनल वुमेंस डे सभी वुमेंस को लेडीज़ को गर्ल्स को जो घर पे हैं वर्किंग हैं बाहर हैं कहीं भी हैं सबको मेरी तरफ से बहुत बहुत मुबारक थैंक यू सो मच हेलो हाय My name is Manpriya or as my friends and family call me Sania. I live in Saskatchewan, Canada and I work for the Saskatchewan government here. Um I was born and raised in Punjab, India and I'm married to the most amazing and honest man from Gujarat. Um This place has given me so much so it is really hard to point out one thing. Um this place is my home. It's my everything but the essence of all of it is that i have become my own person here i have learned to stand up for myself um and that's not uh, something that very many women do back home um also i have discovered camping i love camping i think it is the most amazing way to connect to the nature and to yourself um message for the women would be to all the women across the globe Do not let anybody tell you what you can do or we cannot do. Show them because you know how they say if they ignore you, then they laugh at you, then they fight with you and then you win. Um so yeah, just be yourself because that's who you were born to be. Don't let others or the society to society tell you how to live your life. Um is because no matter what at the end the the love that you were born to find Nobody can steal that for you. It will come find you. So yeah, happy Women's Day and happy empowerment. Peace and love. ਸਤਿ ਸ਼੍ਰੀ ਅਕਾਲ ਜੀ ਸਾਰਿਆਂ ਨੂੰ ਆ ਸਭ ਤੋਂ ਪਹਿਲਾਂ ਤਾਂ ਹੈਪੀ ਵਿਮੈਨਸ ਡੇ ਆ ਸਾਨੂੰ ਪਤਾ ਕਿ ਹੈਪੀ ਵਿਮੈਨਸ ਦਾ ਦਿਨ ਹੈਗਾ ਵਿਮੈਨਸ ਦੇ ਲਈ ਸੈਲੀਬ੍ਰੇਸ਼ਨ ਦਾ ਦਿਨ ਹੈਗਾ ਪਰ ਅਕੋਰਡਿੰਗ ਟੂ ਮੀ ਆ ਇੱਕ ਹੀ ਦਿਨ ਕਿਉਂ ਹੈ ਨਾ ਮੇਰੇ ਖਿਆਲ ਦੇ ਵਿੱਚ 365 ਦਿਨ ਵਿਮੈਨਸ ਦੇ ਲਈ ਸੈਲੀਬ੍ਰੇਸ਼ਨ ਦੇ ਦਿਨ ਹੋਣੇ ਚਾਹੀਦੇ ਨੇ ਕਿਉਂਕਿ ਅੱਜ ਕੱਲ ਕੁੜੀਆਂ ਸਾਨੂੰ ਪਤਾ ਹੈ ਕਿ ਕਿਸੇ ਨਾਲੋਂ ਘੱਟ ਨਹੀਂ ਹੈਗੀਆਂ ਹਰ ਜਗ੍ਹਾ ਤੇ ਮੁੰਡਿਆਂ ਦੇ ਨਾਲ ਮੋਢੇ ਨਾਲ ਮੋਢਾ ਜੋੜ ਕੇ ਚੱਲ ਰਹੀਆਂ ਨੇ ਸੋ ਮੇਰੇ ਖਿਆਲ ਦੇ ਵਿੱਚ ਅਸਲੀ ਸੈਲੀਬ੍ਰੇਸ਼ਨ ਤਦ ਹੋਏਗੀ ਜਦ ਸਾਰੀਆਂ ਕੁੜੀਆਂ ਆਜ਼ਾਦ ਹੋ ਜਾਣਗੀਆਂ ਇੱਕ ਗੱਲ ਹੋਰ ਹੈਗੀ ਹੈ ਕਿ ਠੀਕ ਹੈ ਜੇਕਰ ਮੇਲ ਤੁਹਾਡੇ ਤੇ ਫੀਮੇਲਸ ਦੇ ਉੱਤੇ ਕੋਈ ਵੀ ਕਹੀਏ ਤਾਂ ਉਹਨਾਂ ਨੂੰ ਡਾਊਨ ਕਰਨ ਦੀ ਆਪਣਾ ਹੱਕ ਜਤਾਉਂਦੇ ਨੇ ਉਹਨਾਂ ਨੂੰ ਡਾਊਨ ਕਰਨ ਦੀ ਕੋਸ਼ਿਸ਼ ਕਰਦੇ ਨੇ ਕਿਤੇ ਨਾ ਕਿਤੇ ਰੀਜ਼ਨ ਉਹਦੇ ਪਿੱਛੇ ਕੁੜੀਆਂ ਖੁਦ ਵੀ ਹੁੰਦੀਆਂ ਨੇ ਕਿਉਂਕਿ ਬਹੁਤ ਸਾਰੀਆਂ ਕੁੜੀਆਂ ਬਹੁਤ ਸਾਰੀਆਂ ਫੀਮੇਲਸ ਇਦਾਂ ਦੀਆਂ ਨੇ ਜੋ ਕਿ ਆਪਣੇ ਹੱਕ ਦੇ ਲਈ ਆਵਾਜ਼ ਹੀ ਨਹੀਂ ਚੁੱਕਦੀਆਂ ਉਹਨਾਂ ਨੂੰ ਲੱਗਦਾ ਕਿ ਸ਼ਾਇਦ ਸਾਨੂੰ ਆਪਣੀ ਜ਼ਿੰਦਗੀ ਦੇ ਵਿੱਚ ਜਿਉਣ ਦੇ ਲਈ ਕਿਸੇ ਨਾ ਕਿਸੇ ਮੇਲ ਦੀ ਜ਼ਰੂਰਤ ਹੈਗੀ ਆ ਜੇ ਅਸੀਂ ਸਾਡਾ ਹਸਬੰਦ ਚਾਹੇ ਸਾਨੂੰ ਮਾਰੇ ਕੁੱਟੇ ਪਰ ਜੇਕਰ ਅਸੀਂ ਉਹ ਉਹਨੂੰ ਛੱਡ ਦਿੱਤਾ ਜ਼ਿੰਦਗੀ ਪਤਾ ਨਹੀਂ ਕੀ ਹੋ ਜਾਏਗੀ ਜਾਂ ਘਰ ਦੇ ਵਿੱਚ ਉਹਨਾਂ ਦੇ ਭਰਾ ਉਹਨਾਂ ਦੀ ਫੈਮਿਲੀ ਪੇਰੈਂਟਸ ਵੱਲੋਂ ਉਹਨਾਂ ਨੂੰ ਦਬਾ ਕੇ ਰੱਖਿਆ ਜਾਂਦਾ ਤੇ ਉਹ ਦੱਬ ਵੀ ਜਾਂਦੀਆਂ ਨੇ ਸੋ ਮੇਰੇ ਖਿਆਲ ਦੇ ਵਿੱਚ ਖੁਦ ਹੀ ਤੁਹਾਨੂੰ ਕੁੜੀਆਂ ਨੂੰ ਆਵਾਜ਼ ਚੁੱਕਣੀ ਪਏਗੀ ਤਦ ਹੀ ਸਾਰਾ ਕੁਝ ਠੀਕ ਹੋ ਪਾਏਗਾ ਸੋ ਸੈਲੀਬ੍ਰੇਟ ਕਰੋ ਇਸ ਦਿਨ ਨੂੰ ਪਰ ਸੈਲੀਬ੍ਰੇਟ ਕਰੋ ਸਾਰੇ 365 ਦਿਨ ਜਿਹੜੇ ਆ ਉਹਨੂੰ ਸੈਲੀਬ੍ਰੇਸ਼ਨ ਬਣਾਓ ਵਿਮੈਨਸ ਦੇ ਲਈ